me this game. Okay, we're recording, and we're not talking about Anime Mario Party <laughs> anymore. Good, thank you. <laughs> Let's talk about stacking! We are done with Anime Mario Party. Which, um, from my understanding, is uh, double fine, and it is also adorable. That's the mm -hmm. other thing I've heard. And I have two it adventures, is. by default. Original Adventure and The Lost Hobo King. Uh, Lost Hobo King is just a thing you should do if you do original. Okay. Yeah. Please type just... your save name. Stacking is actually pretty good. I really enjoyed yeah. it. Okay. Sounds like it might be a little loud. Are you gonna stack this boners tie? Yeah. I like how silent we are, uh, like, just out of respect <laughs> for this. Yeah it's, yeah, it's nice. I'm not gonna... It's nice. The... Yeah. Like, the aesthetic and the music and all that is, is very pleasant. Mm -hmm. Like, I still think stacking is probably my favorite Double Fine game. Like, I, I think it's better than Costume Quest just because I, I think it's a whole lot cuter. Yeah, I, I would actually maybe be inclined to agree because i i actually really enjoyed stacking uh, mm -hmm. like i uh, also really enjoyed costume quest but there's just yeah. something about stacking to me that i kind of like it has that really like old adventure game feeling yeah and uh, a lot of the puzzles have a lot of really neat uh ingenuity to them uh and then also just overall this game is super charming and I, I, uh, about how long is it? Do you guys know? Um, I think about several six hours. To eight hours. Yeah. yeah, that's not too bad actually. That's yeah. that is a pleasant length for me, yeah. someone who does not like to play games that are seven hundred hours long. Yeah, it, it very much depends on if you wanna, uh, because every single puzzle has several uh, solutions to it. Oh, okay. uh, so it really depends on if you just want to solve every puzzle once or find every uh, solution, because then you will like maybe triple uh, the amount of time you you spend on it. Okay, I'm just loving the movement already. Yeah. Okay. Well, get all three people to leave the lounge.
But yeah, that's one of those things I always really like about Double Fun games, even when, like, the gameplay isn't really up to par. Like, at least it always has a certain sense of charm about it. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, yeah definitely. Like I said, they thrive on charm. There's no two ways about it. It's kind of why I thought um, something like uh, that space-based uh, space DF7, I believe. Or DS9. That, DS9, yeah. yeah. That, that one was kind of weird uh, in the way that it doesn't really fit, isn't fit with what I kind of perceive Double Fine games to be. I mean, it, of course, it's nice for them that they're branching out. Yeah, but yeah for I, them I, that they canceled all production on it. Oh, they did? I think so, yeah. That's what oh, I heard. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> no, I think they said, said like that they released a 1.0 like, a couple of days ago. Mm -hmm. And they're not doing any more development on it, I think. Yeah, it didn't sound um, like it was doing very well. Mm -hmm. I mean, honestly, Hack and Slash sounded like the way better Early Access game. Oh yeah, that one sounded actually really interesting. Yeah, thanks for buying Early Access, fuckers. Um... <laughs> All right, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and turn the volume down a little bit. See, also, quite... I think Space Base DF9 wasn't developed by Double Fine, only published. Yeah, it was published uh, by them, I believe. Uh, wasn't it? Uh, or no, no, it wasn't. No, never mind. Okay. Yeah, this definitely kind of is kind of bleeding the Double Fine style, though. This is. Oh no, it was de uh, developed by Double Fine. Oh, it was? Yeah. Oh, it's still in early access. Capture people. Yep. <laughs> that that is the core mechanic of this game, and it's really great. Also, I think every like uh, model has like different speeches uh, to other models. Yes. Uh, also, different uh, overall interactions. Um, as you're seeing here, every uh, different kind of model has uh, their own ability. Yep. So, uh, Lady can sip tea, uh, big guy can scream, make way. <laughs> so I've got to convince these guys to leave. cough on this guy. Didn't work. Gross as hack. Yeah, I need to fit through a small space, it says. Mm -hmm. So is that. Oh, this guy owns. This guy can break dance. Yep, you found him. <laughs> you found me, Ty. Can Congratulations. I... Oh, okay, I was figuring I could maybe fit through the bars or something. Okay, so I need to find and stack with the key master. Now, if you were a key master, where would you be? Hmm. Well, there's someone who. Oh, oh no, wait. Never mind. Um, wasn't there? I seem to recall there was something for locating specific uh, characters. For locating objectives. What? 
For like locating objectives, there's like an indicator maybe or something. Yeah, I, I seem to remember there was something like that, but it, it's been a while since I played this. Well, Tech, you should go find the keymaster. I think the keymaster's okay. around. I, I, I think he's like eight. in the center of the of the lounge yeah. room uh, by the gate. Oh, the puzzle here is just getting yeah, big enough duh. since I think he's the bucket biggest size. Duh. Yeah. I'll give you a clue. Which I'll let you guys see if you uh, can yeah. figure out which one's the keymaster. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Does he have a huge master above his head? Yeah. Yeah. Damn. Good. It's a dominatrix. <laughs> well, bye. Well, bye. I'm gonna be the gunman. No, don't. Oh, okay. They're cool. Now I get the uh, intuition. Oh, yeah. Oh, cool. It's got the dead space uh, goop arrow or the Bioshock <laughs> Infinite poop arrow. Yeah. But um, actually looks nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I love this goop arrow. It's made of blood. Yeah, it's actually pretty. Looks like an Aurora Borealis, but a ground. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, ground. I think Aurora. other games also, besides Dead oh, Space wait, of Gundam. Check out my. Well, I was going to say Bioshock Infinite had the one that was like. It looked like a Nickelodeon slime arrow. <laughs> Just like the plot of Bioshock Infinite? Uh. This is officially better than the Shrek game. <laughs> <laughs> I think I know who you found. Listen, hey, can you help Ty, me? I can't agree with you in any way whatsoever. <laughs> Shrek 2 is pretty damn fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, you're just doing donuts, just burping all over. Well, everyone has Ebola now. Later. <laughs> yep. <laughs> just okay. spinning barf brodies. So just reminding on me, talking is lot. super important. <laughs> I've got the ability to listen. Okay. <laughs> the best ability. Mm. <laughs> Quit listening to this man's junk. Come on. Be polite. Okay, so I have to find... A way to get around this. Mm -hmm. So this is the the first puzzle with uh, several different solutions. Okay. And it can't stack this man because he's standing on a carousel. Uh, yes. See, this lady looks like she'd be invited. She's a fancy lady. So, um... I looked up Space Space DF9, and apparently one cool thing they did was just release a source code so the community could work on things. Uh... It's kind of a cop-out, because then it's just like, yeah, the community can fucking fix this game once we put it mm -hmm. out. Because yeah. it doesn't seem like it's done. Oh. It also just doesn't seem like their kind of game, to be honest. Yeah, it yeah. really does not seem like a double fine game. It's It's a weird one. Oh, cool. So this lady has the ability to, like, figure out who I can inhabit, I guess. Oh, yeah. it's Eagle Vision. Damn. Yeah, it's... Yeah, this is Assassin's Creed all over again. Yeah. How do I get invited? I can't wait to parkour with these Matraska dolls. <laughs> you don't necessarily need to be invited, though. It's true. Yeah, um... There are other ways of going about this. Oh! I yeah, need to be I... Tony Burpo. Here's the thing. You no, no, I'm using... This. I got a good strategy. I'm going to burp in the vents. See, it's, now you're doing uh, this correctly. Yeah, I'm going to go burp in their vent. 
that's the really nice thing I love about this game. There's just for every like puzzle tree major ways to solve it. Yeah, that that's the thing that I uh, like the most about this is you can really be creative and flexible around this kind of stuff. Oh, this isn't an actual solution, is it? Not with burping. Ah, uh, not with burping, huh? Nope. Can I just yell in the vent? <laughs> well, when you said that you uh, it was better than Shrek, uh, I didn't think you had found the burping guy. Oh, there's a fartman? <laughs> What's like, I'm gonna seduce this guard. Look at that booty, damn fine booty. Get with the booty, <laughs> down with the booty. <laughs> booty town. How do I open the door? <laughs> Shit. I got him out of the way, but I don't know how to open the door now. Hmm. Hmm. Should you become him? I think you should just oh, talk to the dude. No, yeah, steal. Oh, I have to seduce him again. Okay, no, I've got the I got the right idea here. Yo, lady, gonna give him an old case of the booty doll. I'm gonna seduce him a little more, then unstack, and then steal his corpse. <laughs> Fucked up. But true. And you've got two guys after you. You, you were mistaken. It is I who would get inside of you. <laughs> <laughs> Too oh, switcheroo. Okay, I need to talk to the host. It was apparently this way. But yeah, one other thing that's also neat is that after you solve the puzzle, you can do it in other ways. Oh. Mm -hmm. So you said find and talk to the host is the... What? I think the host is just... Oh, uh, it's just, I mean the challenge, so it just leads me back to the opening of the challenge. See the host, will you? Well, who... Who is the host? If only there were someone who could show you who the host was. Uh, okay, so I gotta... Okay, yeah, sure, let's try another solution. Uh oh, and get match sets. <laughs> I'm figuring you you found the one that I usually do. This is the best set ever. <laughs> oh. oh, yeah, that one. That rules. So now I can talk to the strikers, I guess? <laughs> <laughs> oh god, I just saw full steam ahead, yes! Yep. <laughs> chew. Fucking chew. <laughs> 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 All aboard! So now that you've learned biotic charge, uh, you can get up <laughs> right in the, the face of people and really dish it out on these goddamn communists.
I mean, this game is cute, but on the other hand, holy shit, this is depressing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And that's really what also adds a lot to the charm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Just, it's the Industrial Revolution. Everything is horrible. Yeah. <laughs> yup. Everyone's dying from coal contamination in their lungs and horribly underpaid and exploited and yeah. Oh. oh, I just got an ability. It's sad. <laughs> now I'm getting teabagged by a pigeon. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this game for uh, person who asked in the chat is called Stacking. S T A C K I N G. It is a double fine game. It's on Steam. Not sure of the yeah. price. It was included in I a think bundle. It's like ten bucks. I actually have a code for this game if anyone is interested. Oh, really? Yes. Well, you can uh, feel free to <clears throat> ask the chat and figure that out. Tell them to tweet at you or something, or at me. Either way. Oh yeah, yeah. I actually we can figure also something out. Yeah, have some codes to give out if you're fun with that time. Ceremonial knife fight. No, that's cool. All right. Um, yeah, ceremonial knife fight. That's all figured out. Uh, we'll just wait until uh, after I finish up stacking and then go through all that. Yeah, we'll figure that out once uh, we get through this. hideout thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this game is just charming as shit. Mm -hmm. I really recommend it if you don't have it. <laughs> it's, it's, it's good. It's a good game. The game is good. Eloquently put. Really sweet, actually. <laughs> yes. Yeah, this is nice. This is nice. Mm -hmm. See, there's... The thing about the Steam Pit is, as opposed to the ROM Pit, where like 99% of it is just fucking trash, there's only been like 85% trash. <laughs> it's a good ratio, comparatively. Yeah, I mean, we had uh, anger and chill, and now just nice. I mean, this yeah. is nice. Yeah. And there's you, no salt. You got that natural but... filter of things that manage to wind up on your Steam list in the first place. So. Yeah, yeah. Like so all the stuff that's it's... enraged you has been like bundle cruft. Which yeah. is a great word that more people should use. Bundle it's... cruft. Spread bundle it. cruft? Make it happen. Bundle cruft. Yeah, I no, I'm down for some bundle cruft. cruft. Yes. Alright, let's talk to conductor. You don't need a ticket to ride this train, baby. Damn. Ha hashtag Bundlecroft. And the cutscenes are really well done, too. They're presented as kind of, uh... I don't know what the term for that is, actually. Yeah, I actually don't know either. Like, the the kind of very low-rent uh, street side. Uh, yeah, it's kind of a mix of, like, Penny Opera with a bit of silent film tacked on in the front. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's the right way to put it, I think. Yeah, I kind of like a puppet show type. Yeah, deal. puppet like show kind. Play of. style, mm -hmm. penny theater, puppet show, silent film. It's got a lot happening, and it's all with Metrio Metrio dolls. Metros dolls. Metroska. Matryoshka. Matryoshka is not that Glory to Matryoshka. Matryoshka! <laughs> <laughs> That's what I say before my super move. <laughs> <laughs> I 
And then I jam myself into the corpse of my adversary and walk around as them for a bit. (laughs) (laughs) You're the best new Mortal Kombat character. Yeah, fucked up but true. Yep. Good old reverse Kirby. (laughs) Yeah, the reverse curves. (laughs) I jam myself and my opponent and then they just become part of... I get their abilities on the inside, though. (laughs) (laughs) Oh man, I love that Captain Doll. I want that in real life. Yep. <laughs> that one's amazing. <laughs> I'm actually kind of curious if they actually made any of these dolls to, to sell. Oh, that would be I, awesome. I believe they did. Let me. Um, I know they made um, Thomas Was Alone action figures, so. Isn't Thomas oh, Was Alone it. just little pixels? Yes. yes. That's why they're, it was they're ridiculous. Just, it was they're just, just rectangles like, of different yeah. colors. I mean. God damn it. Like, I heard Thomas was alone is was good, so good on that guy. But still, I played a little bit of it. Yeah, I think it was a yeah. joke thing. Yeah, I'm. I'm oh man! There's... Oh man! There's a hijinks list. Oh yeah! F- yes. Fuck yes! Oh, this game keeps getting better. Time for the yeah. hijinks. Get slammed, motherfucker! Yeah, the the ship is really where it starts <laughs> getting really good. There's a lot of really great things to do on the ship. Yeah, the ship is also way more open in general. Yeah, it's huge. <laughs> oh, sorry, I'm just... <laughs> nice hat, stupid! <laughs> Get fucked! <laughs> hey, nice safari, asshole! Oh, man, he's invincible. How about you, we tot? Get slapped. <laughs> How about you, weest of tots? Oh, man, that... <laughs> That weest of tot could avoid my slap. Get spanked, motherfucker. How about you? Are you an actual lion or are you just... Oh, you're just wearing a mask. Nice mask, idiot. (laughs) 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 Alright. That was good. That was good. I feel better. (laughs) Oh man, I got a larger, even larger size doll. Who punches dudes. Get wrecked. Nice safari. Oh. And his ability is a proper uppercut. Oh, oh no. yes. A proper uppercut. Okay, I want to be the cannoneer. I already know this. Yes! <laughs> fuck yo flamingos! Fuck yo gamingos. Yeah, fuck yo gamingos! <laughs> oh. There we go, there's some of that chaos I was looking to start. <laughs> chaos. Yeah, I don't ex- I don't actually know if you can replay levels by the way if you like want to do different solution to puzzles. I I believe you can. All right, cuz I think one of the things that you like to do in general is just find all the unique guys. Mm. Yeah. <clears throat> all right, cool. Oh, and there's a bunch of solutions for it. This is yeah. Awesome, actually. This is yeah. fucking great. There, there's like a couple of these puzzles that had like five different solutions and such. Man. Man. Stacking's really good. I've never heard of this game before. Yes, yeah, It's great. Sugar Rush. Yeah. <laughs> like, it's, uh, what it's, an ability. Holy shit. It's not as well known as uh, other Double Fine games, but I still think it's just the best one. Yeah. Help. I have become <laughs> sugar coma. <laughs> it's the rolling at the end that really makes it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then your controls are kind of like messed up for a little bit. Yeah. Oh man, let me be a baby in a stroller.
I don't think I can move as the Wii Tot, though. I don't think you can. Well, you can cry, so... Mm -hmm. I think that's all you want. That's all waste you something. God, that's an ugly baby. Yeah, yep. that's a hell of a babe. <laughs> Them some cheeks. Where? That looks like an adult man. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna own somebody with this thing. <laughs> Get owned. Suck paddleball, motherfucker. Shit. How delightfully improper. <laughs> Oh man! I don't understand this ability. There's a there's a decent amount of the abilities that are they, they don't actually serve any function. Um, oh, okay. Like aside from just being kind of amusing, um, though most of them do have a a uh, something they can be used for uh, for a puzzle. I'm just entertaining people. That's admirable. Yes. Oh, parasol. What? I tell this guy good day and he slaps the shit out of me. <laughs> what an asshole. Just how he says hello. Stop being such a cocky wait, little fucker wait, then. Wait, 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 no! Oh. Get back here, bicycle! No! You are mine! Oh, you finally saw the bicycle. Yes! <sighs> yes! Everything is great! I don't know if it does anything other than make me go fast, but I am okay with that. Is this just like how this is the teleport of this stage? Rolling around uh, yes, at the it speed is. of sound. I can ring the bell. Oh, yeah, actually, uh, Festivore in the chat makes a good observation. All the umbrellas are like little drink umbrellas. <laughs> I love that the mechanism yeah. for driving the bicycle is to just bounce up and down <laughs> on a yeah. piston. <laughs> yeah, when do we get that? Seriously. Oh, yeah, I haven't been talking to people either. All right, well, I just kind of want to show it off. So, Steam Pit, as you do. Time to... Move on, I'm afraid. Yeah. I'm I think I might I think I might like play this game again. This is Yeah. This is a really good game. It's really good. I like it. 